brought Braun a championship. I think Ty Lue has been there every season because they always get hurt. He goes in the game not even knowing if they're going to play or not. So if they can just get into the playoffs healthy, no matter the seed, I think they're going to be able to make some noise in the playoffs. A lot of ifs in there, Kevin. A lot of ifs. A lot of ifs. A lot of ifs. A lot of, a lot of ifs. ifs. But I think there's they do going have... to be there's going to be more ifs in this next factor cap. Oh, so, Toddy, I'm going to bring it to you next. I had everybody bring a list of their top bigs in the Western Conference that can make the all-star game. So, Toddy, factor cap. Victor Wilmiana will be an all-star this season. Oh, man. want to give a special shout-out to Victor Wilmiana for ruining my parlay last night because he had 40 <laughs> in the game that – Devin Booker comes back. They were up by 20 literally the entire game. I don't know if I, I watched the entire game. Um, not by choice. But um, uh, if you kind of just watch the entire game, they just really didn't have an answer for him. Um, Victor pretty much did anything that he wanted. He had a play where the dude, he was, had his back to the basket, and he threw it to the, he threw it towards the rim, and he dunked it. And I was like – the hell are you supposed to you can't stop that and you see like the pictures of kd next to wimby and wimby's like so much taller than him it's insane um but i'm looking at as far as bigs go the two bigs best bigs that i've seen in the west are ad and Jokic, and then it's kind of just like everybody else so i'm like how many all-star spots reserve i mean there's 12 spots, I, I believe. There's 12. Yeah, I say it's eight on the Is Wimby going to be an all star right now, today? Wow. I don't. There's 12 roster spots or 12? There's 12 roster spots. I'm I'm assuming there's two of. No, that wouldn't. There's three of something, but I mean, it, that, there's only that one wild card spot. I don't and I think that the difference now is now the posi- it's positionless with the voting. Is Ooh. he the is he the is he one of the twelve best players in the West right now? No, I can't say I'm, that. So I'm gonna have to say Cap. I get it. Wimby had forty last night against Kevin Durant, which is you know one of his idols, guys he grew up watching. I mean it's. It's tough to say no after that performance, but I'm like, is he? But I'm looking at it as, is he one of the twelve best players in the West? And I'm going to have to say cap on that. Um, I'm a guy who's came out on this podcast. I've said it several times. February, when the ball dropped to San Antonio Spurs, in which Sean said he would have took the odds were at plus five fifty, and Sean was like, "Well, I think that." Greg Popovich and the Spurs are going to get him. I'm like, Sean, you're crazy. There's no way in hell Wimby's going to the Spurs. And then that day comes, the ball drops. Literally, I don't know if it was that day or that weekend. Could have won some money, a lot of money on that. Um, Pop signs. Could have, would have. Pop signs for five years. I don't think that's a coincidence that they got the lottery, Pop's contracts up, and then, oh, hey, we got the number one pick. We're going to get who? Yeah, let me sign for let me resign five years on the data line. So um I've always said that I think the Spurs are going to the make the play in for sure. Um I stand on that. I've been standing on that since February. You guys quote me, go back all the way to when the lottery um show was and read whatever, listen to whatever I said. But um I think this team could definitely make the play in just because I on how gifted I believe and saw and thought how good he was going to be and it's been showing but i'm still gonna i'm gonna say cap for this segment just because i don't think he's one of the 12 best players in the west right now he's not one of the 24 best players in the league right now i feel like maybe in a year i could be wrong i could be wrong you guys can pull this clip up for me three four months from now and be like this is the guy that said whippy's not gonna be an all-star i'm gonna be like hey I was wrong, but right now this is what game five, four, five, four or five games in. Gotta say cap for right now. All right, Alex, I'm gonna bring it to you next. Factor cap, Victor Wimbinyana. Wimbinyama will be an all star this season. I think, like Tati said, he's not the top 12 in the league, but if I'm 
correct me if I'm wrong, was Zion Williamson an all-star his rookie year as well? No, no I think granted, he was hurt his rookie year, but his, his actual first hurt. year, like, playing a lot his of games. His actual first year. So yeah. my my thing is – And I think in that year, Zion played, like, 20-something games. <laughs> it's still oh. been the all-star game. And he was also a starter. But it, yeah. continue. <laughs> Nuts. And so my biggest thing is I think it's – I don't think he's going to, but I think the NBA is a business at the end of the day, and people want to see Victor mm. in an all-star jersey. So yeah. it's going to happen. People – because I think it's – isn't it based on voting? People are going to vote him in. Like, Well, I think the starters is voting. I think the bench is uh, you have to be picked. I think starters are voted on. Yes, that's okay. what it is. Uh. That's okay. correct. Okay. I, I just think that – they're going to put him in one of those slots. Now, is he top 12? No. But oh, especially in the there. West. But he's definitely going. I think he's going to be in the in an all-star jersey. So I say fact. Wow. All right, Sean. We have a fact and we have a cap. I'm going to bring it to you next. Fact or cap. Victor Wimanyama will be an all-star this season. I love it when fact or cap gets split like this. This is great. Um, so – that is correct, Alex, that Zion made the All-Star game in his second season. LeBron also made the All-Star game in his second season. But I'm here to tell you all that Victor Wembenyama is going to make the All-Star game as a rookie. He dropped 38 points last night against the Suns in his, uh, in, in his uh, fifth game overall, but it was his second time beating the Suns so far this season. Back-to-back games, he beat the Suns. <laughs> back-to-back games. And so, according to ESPN Stats and Info, Victor Wembanyama is the first player with 100 points and 10 blocks in their first five career games since Shaquille O'Neal back in 1992. His 38 points are tied for the third most in a game by a Spurs rookie all-time. Only David Robinson had reached that mark previously. This guy is special. Like, he is – he's fucking ridiculous. I don't really know much else to say because the reason why I'm almost lost for words is because we saw him doing this overseas, and we all kind of marveled at it at the time. Now he has just seamlessly made the transition to the NBA, and he's going toe-to-toe with Kevin Durant. Before he played Kevin Durant for the first time, the media was asking Kevin, saying – you're Victor's favorite player. How does it make you feel? Kevin just said, I feel old. That's how it makes me feel. But the fact that Victor can walk in on day one and go head to head with one of the best players in the NBA game of five. all time, perhaps <laughs> game five and drop 38 points and to beat Kevin Durant twice. Like the first game, it was kind of wild how the Spurs won it at the end. And Toddy, I don't know if you bet on that one because it would Which be one? painful if you did. Oh, the, the, uh, the, the first, the first time, time that, the, yeah, the first time that the Spurs beat the Suns when Almost the did. Suns basically just gave it away at the end. Uh, but anyways, to answer the question, this is a fact. Victor Wembenyama will be an all-star as a rookie. I mean, if you just Thank watch you. the game, they just they had no answer for him. Like, he's going down. He's hit pull-up three. He's, he's there is no by, answer. He's blown by defenders. You try to post him up. You can't, they're trying to front the post. They just throw it over him. Like there's you you there's literally no answer for this thing. Pick and roll. There's no answer. He can, he can pick and roll. He can pick and pop. He can dribble all the way down, and I mean he can bring the ball up. I mean I don't I don't I don't know what you. There's really no answer for this guy. It's, it's very hard. No. No. You can't, exactly. you can't really stop him. So. Factor cap. Victor Wembanyama will be an All Star this season. You guys put out all the numbers, but I'm gonna give you some ones that we haven't heard yet. Only Spurs to put up 35 points and a double-double. I'm sure we can all name the three Spurs on this list, so I'll do it for us. We have Victor Wimbenyama, Tim Duncan, and David Robinson. Like ever? The only teen ever. The only teenagers <laughs> in NBA history to record 35 points, 10 rebounds, two blocks. LeBron? Can anybody give me those other two guys? LeBron, is he one of them? LeBron is one of them. Uh, uh, Will Chamberlain? Nope, he's a current Shaq. player. Oh, current player. Damn. Luca? Nope. It's tougher because they got rid of the 80? they got rid of the high school rule a while back. Uh-uh. You said he has to be a teenager? Oh. Yes. Dwight they, Howard? They were, when when they did it, they were teenagers. So the second Dwight player, Howard? No, it's Kevin Durant. 
Uh, oh, so he is on a list with with pretty good comp with pretty good company. I saw another so list can he like him, Steph, and like LeBron and all those? Yeah. yeah. So can he be an All Star in his first year? Hell yeah! Like Alex said, took the words from my notes. She it looked like she might have been here when I was typing my notes. The NBA is a <laughs> business. Every so often we get a superstar into the NBA. The Luka Doncic, the LeBron James, the Kevin Durant. They're all spaced out. So when they come, they're going to make a huge impact from day one. Alex and even Sean are K-pop fans, and they single-handedly got Andrew Wiggins into the starting five. The <laughs> NBA is a business. Victor Wimbanyana can't be an all-star. And another no thing way. that no, no one way. mentioned was the guys Zaza. in front of him get hurt a lot. You know, Anthony Davis, is he going to be hurt? That is a, is that the is going to be hurt? Too. Yeah. So, you know, he's definitely a top five big man, but if the other two guys ahead of him are hurt, oh, or he's getting in, he's getting in. <laughs> or he can be an injury reserve for a guard because, like Sean mentioned, it's positionless. Right. So do I believe he's going to make it on the first go? Yes. But wow. if there is an injury, a sick, a COVID, a anything, they're not even <laughs> calling nobody else. It's straight to Victor. Player. Like, hey, Victor, pack your bags and come. If, if the one plays, you're just coming to watch. But if someone puts an ankle or anything, Victor Wimanyama, year one, all star. Well, so I'm gonna, gonna have to go fast for like the rising. He's gonna be in the rising stars. He's not so. playing in no rising stars game. <laughs> for what? He's a star. But the I'm other one's like, a rising. LeBron he's he's risen. In his first year, and LeBron was literally the chosen one. He didn't even make his first year. That's kind of what I'm looking at. It like, like LeBron didn't make it his first. Year. I'm like Kevin. You're the LeBron all of this year. You're supposed to be preaching the word of how LeBron didn't even make it his first year. And now all of a sudden, Wimby's gonna make it, which is insane to say. So I'm pretty LeBron sure back in back in 2003, three. it was like coaches voting you in. But now that it, it's a business, dude, like oh, he definitely. got, he's like Taylor Swift. They go, everyone in Paris is put <laughs> a Victor Wimby and Yama starting. T- they're gonna hit the NBA app and hit Victor, 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 Victor. That's a whole country. That's a whole country. There's no way he's not an all star. The only way he's not an all star is if they're hurt. Toddy mentioned that he has them as a play in lock. The Spurs had the number one pick a season ago. If he gets them to the play in, that has to be enough to get him into the all star game. So I'm going to have to go fact as well. Would that be it? That'd be hindsight because the plan will be after the all star game. But well, I mean, they'll still be on, on pace. They'll be, they'll be better than they were at all star break last year. The Spurs are the fifth seed currently, or tied for the fifth seed. Hey, man. Victor Show. Well, uh, the vote is currently at three to one that Victor will be an all star. And let's just make it four to one because we have two members of the Dent family on this panel. And now let's make it a third. As uh, Mr. Dent says, fact, he does a little bit of everything. Plus, he was calling for the ball down the stretch. The hype will make him an all star or fill in, not a starter. And tell us how you really feel, Kevin. Tell us how you really feel. That's. That's what we all want to know. Uh,